He's wearing a white shirt with a mask over his head. What color is the mask? It looks like a, a Freddy Krueger mask. What, and he got a like a Halloween mask? Yes. Disturbing 911 calls just days before Halloween when a suspect allegedly pulls a gun on multiple people, all while wearing a Michael Myers mask. Smith was wearing a mask during the crimes that led up to the shooting. The mask worn by Smith was collected for evidence. You can see the photo to my left. It is a white Halloween mask. It happened on October 10th in North Las Vegas, Nevada. Just before 5.30 that evening, a 911 call came in for a man with a gun at a public park. 911, do you have a police fire or medical emergency? Yes, it is. A man just pulled a gun on me. When the call dropped, officers attempted to get in contact with the caller again. He later explained he was running for his life. And the officers, when the officers called you, you didn't answer. What happened? Well, I'm sorry. I had to get away. I don't want to get shot. The caller told dispatch the suspect ran from the park to a nearby car wash. He said the suspect was wearing a Halloween mask. He wearing a white shirt with a mask over his head. What color is the mask? It looks like a, a Freddy Krueger mask. What, and he got a like a Halloween mask? Yes. Officials later released this image of the mask the suspect wore, identifying it as a Michael Myers mask from the horror franchise Halloween. He's wearing green socks, green shoes, a white t-shirt, and a Freddie Myers uh, what kind of A separate 911 caller from a nearby grocery store reported seeing the masked man as well. We have a, uh, I work at the Terry Mini Mart. We have a guy out there that has a gun and he's pulled it on a co couple of customers. He's kind of wacko. North Las Vegas police officer Anthony Malier responded to the 911 calls. He arrived to find the suspect, later identified as 44-year-old Christopher Earl Smith, still wearing the Michael Myers mask. Upon Officer Malier's arrival, he made contact with Smith who was wearing a Halloween mask in the park, the North Las Vegas Justice Center. Body camera footage shows Malir attempting to call out to Smith, telling him to stop. Hey, police, stop right there. Hey, stop. Stop right there, it's police. Officer Malir opens fire after Smith walks into an area with five bystanders and reaches for a gun in his waistband. Put your hands up. Put your hands up, dude, I'm not playing with you. Stop reaching, don't reach. Later investigations found Malir fired eight shots. Smith was shot in the arm, leg, and torso. He died as a result of his injuries. Smith was armed with one black 9mm Ruger that was later determined to be stolen. Investigators say Smith had a long criminal history, including previous convictions for battery with a deadly weapon, battery by strangulation, and evading a police officer. Had he survived, he would have faced multiple charges, including robbery with a deadly weapon and possession of a stolen firearm. Officer Malir was placed on paid administrative leave as the investigation continues. For the latest developments in this story and all things true crime, stay with Long Crime Network. I'm Sierra Gillespie.